Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of 60 Formula. It's first thing in the morning. We got Britney Spears laying over here on my left. He's like, dude, it's it's 8.30 in the morning. I'm really, really tired. We got Gila over here on my right and she's like, I'm awake. I'm awake. Yes, yeah, time for that wake up time. Good girl. That's such a good princess. You're such a good princess. And today we're waking up and we're watching Zeus the Greedy Husky live stream on the big screen, baby. So if you guys aren't familiar with Zeus the Greedy Husky, go ahead and check them out on YouTube. Subscribe if you'd like. Gila and Britney Spears love to watch their live streams early in the morning. I'm pretty sure they live in South Africa or something like that, so every time we wake up in the morning, their live streams are already up. So basically, I figured we'd go over our morning routine. We fell asleep on the couch last night, so we just like, we're all waking up on the sofa this morning. Uh, what's up, bro? Time to wake up, it's that early morning. And usually what I do is I let them go potty. That's like the first thing we do. You ready to go potty? Come on, let's go. Yeah! Potty time, it's time for potty time, oh yeah! Potty time, it's time for potty time, oh yeah! Walk on over to the leash. So I set my leash up just like this. It already has the collar attached to it. So I don't have to like go and get a separate collar. The collar's already attached to the leash. This is something easy that you can do if you wanna just get your dog on a leash real quick to take him out. What are you, you ready or something? <laughs> All right, let's open the door up. Oh. I gotta put this on you. We gotta put, we gotta put it on you. Are you ready, lady? All right, so the deal is, is Gila typically goes out first every single morning. She gets dibs. The reason we let Gila go out in the morning first is for a couple reasons. One, she's a lady. <laughs> she's also the boss of the house, so she's like, I, I gotta go pee. Look at all the floofy fluff that's literally in my yard right now. This is from Ferminating Gila the other day. All right, come here, you gotta get detached. That's a good girl, that's a good girl. Key sit. That, look at that, what a pro. All right, now Britney Spears is next. He gets to go potty next. You ready, boy? You ready, boy? And he's off to pee the day away. That little duck right there. Little duckaroni pizza with extra duck sauce. He's, you gotta go poo poo, is that it? You done? That's it, that's all, that's all she wrote? Oh, I knew he had to do a number two. I knew there was gonna be a sequel. I knew the sequel was gonna occur. You done? Cool, awesome. The house. Hila does this every time. She's like, I gotta, I gotta freak out. We both just did a potty. Oh my goodness. Oh, the toy. <laughs> All right, boy, we gotta get this off you. Come here. All right. Now both the dogs are free. That's basically potty number one of very many several potties that will occur today. Oh, it's a good Bowie. It's a good Bowie. Is it morning time? Is it morning time? Is the day started? So once Gila has gone to the bathroom and Britney Spears has unloaded a little bit, they both like to get crazy. This is typically where I take them out on a walk, but sometimes I don't. Sometimes I just let them have a little bit of fun and run around the house. Now luckily my house is big enough where the Huskies can run around and do a whole bunch of stuff. There's plenty of room for them to go crazy. If it's super hot because it's summertime, you want to make sure it's a short walk. If you want to take them on a walk super early in the morning, that's a good time because it gets cool in the morning time. It also gets cool right at night when the sun goes down. Let's go open the blinds and see what it looks like today. Oh, Ooh, look outside. Typically what I'll do is I'll open up some windows. Gila likes to look outside in the morning, see what people are doing. She's like, I'd like to know the daily gossip. I'd like to check out the Twitter from indoors. We said, boy, you gonna follow me around for a little bit? You gonna follow me around for a little bit? Come on, let's go. Good boy, come on. Yeah, good boy. Good Bowie. <laughs> He's just a good Bowie. Hello, Mr. Roomba. Ah, welcome to the 60 Formula office. Here's my camera bag in case you guys were wondering where I store all my camera stuff. Got another camera bag right there. And here is the setup. So I come in here like every morning. I do the old clickety click on the mouse and I see what is going on on YouTube. So don't look at my screens. They're super dusty right now. Didn't even notice that. And Britney Spears and Gila usually sit right here. I have a bed, a Vihu pet bed that's right underneath the desk. Britney Spears typically sleeps on this. Gila typically sleeps right here down by my feet or 
over here. Oops, there's some trash on the floor. And so basically what I do is I head to the channel first thing in the morning. I spend a lot of the morning answering comments and trying to answer the questions you guys have on the channel. That's a big part of what I do here is just kind of answering everything. Cause you guys got a lot of questions. I got a lot of answers, but this is, I always come down here to Creator Studio and I get out of it. I go to the classic because this new thing, it just makes me go crazy. So then once this is all done, it'll switch over. This is the classic look. I go over to the community. They fight each other and play tug of war while I do all this. I mean, this is a regular everyday thing. And look, here's all of your published comments. And I, you can see I have not answered a whole bunch of them in a while. So now it's gonna be just uh, probably like two hours of sitting here and going through all your comments. Here's one I answered and answering them all. I'd say it's nine o'clock now at about 11 o'clock. The pups are gonna have to go outside again and go potty and then we'll see what's next. Let me tell you guys, having two Siberian Huskies, it's a lot of work. It's like triple the work, even though it's only double the Husky, it will knock out a lot of that exercising for you. If there's something that's driving you nuts when it comes to Siberian Huskies, and it's that you have to get up out of your day every single day to go and exercise them on a consistent basis, if you have two Huskies, I tell you what, they'll play with each other so much that they'll basically wear themselves out in one area. If I let these guys play all morning, they'll sit here and tug of war, wrestle each other, have a good old time and by 11 o'clock they're basically as tired as if they went on a walk so just keep in mind two huskies is double the trouble and it's really really hard sometimes but it does make parts of the process easier especially if you don't like getting up and going outside every single morning did you dip that in some white paint she's like are you touching my booty are you touching I'm touching your booty all right we just finished answering a whole bunch of comments for a while it's a little bit later in the morning and now we're gonna give the huskies a little bit of a brush down I don't do this every single morning but I do it about every two or three mornings and it just so happens to be that morning so we're gonna give each of these huskies a little booty brush you ready for the booty brush She's like, oh, heck yeah, bro, you know it. She's like, oh, that's the best, Dad. This is like the other day when you were giving me that, that pedicure. Feels good. Oh, yeah. You like, <laughs> you like that? You, you enjoying that? I'm glad. You want the belly? You want the belly done? Yeah, it's a good girl. He's a good girl. Hila loves to be brushed. She's just like, oh, it feels so gush. It feels so good. You get all up the belly area. You're silly. You know that? Yeah, I'll bless you. I'll bless you. Yeah, he's brushing you. What are you gonna do? You gonna get it? You gonna get it? What? <laughs> all right, Britney Spears, it's your turn. You ready? You ready? Oh yeah, let's get some brushes. Let's get some brushes. Oh, I'm sorry, boy. <laughs> yeah, let's get some brushes. Getting brushed all down my back. It feels really great. I need a snack. Good boy. Good boy. That's a good boy. Yeah, that's a good boy. You're looking fresh and fly. I can call you George McFly, right? Yeah, he call you George McFly. I'm gonna comb that tail a whole bunch so it's extra floofy. Gotta get the floofiness. You gotta get that floofiness out, bruh. Today's episode is sponsored by Dr. Trainer, one of the very best dog training collars to get on the market. Now we know that a lot of our viewers are very passionate about their dogs, and typically negative reinforcement is not the route you wanna take when it comes to training. We understand that safety comes first when it comes to dogs, and this is why we choose to promote Dr. Trainer, because it has a lot of safety features that helps to make sure that your dog is constantly safe when you're practicing proper e-collar training. You can see on the side here that it has more than one mode, multiple adjustable correction levels. It's got a 500 yard range. And this is the biggest deal when it comes to this collar because no other collar on the market has this feature. It has retractable prongs. So most e-collars, they'll have these things like metal prongs sticking out that will go into your Husky's neck. It seems like it is very uncomfortable. This collar has retractable prongs. So if you don't want the prongs sticking into your dog's neck, if you wanna make sure that this thing is absolutely never shocking your dog, this is the safest way to go. Dr. Trainer is very nice and sleek and comes with everything that you need straight out of the box. It also comes with a controller. and. 
this means that you can use it for more than just barking correction. You can also use it for off-leash training. A lot of collars that you find are only bark correction collars that respond only to the bark of a dog, but Dr. Trainer covers all your bases so that you can start e-training safely and responsibly. So if you ever wondered about e-collar training, Dr. Trainer is the best place to start. You can rest assured that you're training your doggo to walk off leash and be a good pepperoni pizza while at the same time making sure that you're doing it in an effective and safe way. With Dr. Trainer, it's never been easier. We'll leave everything down below in the description so you guys can get your hands on one of the best training tools when it comes to Siberian Huskies. All right, so it's hitting about that noon time and that was our morning routine. What do you guys do for your morning routine? Leave it in the comments below. We'd love to know what your Siberian Huskies or your dog does in the morning time. Now there was a whole bunch of stuff that sometimes we do in the morning that we didn't do today. Every single morning is different, but this is basically what we do in a nutshell. So if you guys had fun today, hit that like button, hit subscribe, and share pictures of your pets on our Instagram and our Facebook. Links in the description below. And we'll see you next time with another episode of Guess What? Yup, whatever we make. Peace! Ba-da-ba-da-ba-boop-boop. Ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da